I'm Piggy. We will learn how to draw and how to rig and animate. Piggy course. Welcome to this introduction to 2D bone animation with Blender and Grease Pencil. You will learn here everything you need to animate the Piggy, but you can support me by buying the extended version from my Gumroad. The extended course goes at a slower pace for 3 hours, covering drawing, rigging and animation, and packs some extra Blender and Grease Pencil tips and tricks. The rigged Piggy character is included in the download, or you can buy it separately. In part 7, we learn how to make the mouth size react to sound as a simple way to do lip syncing and by the way learn a few advanced settings in the grab editor, how to add sound to our project and more NLA editor practice. Now as a bonus I want to show you a quick and simple way to add lip syncing to your character. Not really lip syncing but something that reacts to the loudness of the audio. So for that we do control tab to go to the graph editor and we select this bone responsible of making the mouth and the shin bigger. Let's go to frame one, shift left arrow, and let's select our channel, the location, the X location. It's, I think, yes, go to item here, the only one that is unlocked and keyframed. And again, let's go back to the action editor to check which channel is selected. I think I will duplicate it and name it piggy.intro. Enter and back to the graph editor, control tab. So this channel is selected. We go to channel. Big sound from F curves. So we click on this one and we can choose an audio file from here. I think it's Piggy voice. Big sound to F curve. Click on this button and we have this. We want here any audio because we will need to add our audio to our sequence editor. Let's change the last frame to 110 here. Let's expand this and go to the, where is it? The video sequencer. Let's go to frame one, shift, left arrow and add sound we will add our sound again yes this one add sound strip and here it is and now we can hear what it says but you see that nothing is happening here and that is because this graph is inverted it's going up and as you remember we added a limit location here so that this bone can't go up we need it instead of course to go down for that we need to go again i think to channel and do and bake curve and now instead of that curve, we have keyframes added. Let's do control tab to see the keyframes. Again, control tab. And we will need to flip this guy here. So we do control M for mirroring and we choose by value over zero value. So the time is this line. So again, control M and we do by values over zero value. And yes, we have our graph flipped. And one thing is weird when we are using normalize here is that these lines are supposed to be on the zero value, but here you see that the zero is down here. And if you try to do G and Y to move it down to the zero, and then you left click, looks like nothing happened. But if you disable normalize, you see that now the graph is under zero. So let's do control Z and without normalize, we see that it was right all along. So be careful with that. Now we have the graph flipped. And if we test it, shift left arrow again and Hello, we Amy. animate, we get this. We will learn how to draw. So it's working, but it's too much. So we try to resize this guy. So here we are on a 2D plane and we don't have a Z axis. So instead of Z here on the viewport, we have Y on the vertical axis and we have X on the horizontal axis. So you do S, X, you resize like this. And if you do S, Y, you resize like this. So we resize it. We have shorter peaks now. And then we do G, Y to move it back to zero with normalized disabled, of course. And we try again. So it seems that we still have to scale the graph down. Again, S, Y, again, G, Y. Test again. Hello, I'm Piggy. We will learn how to draw. This looks better. Of course, let's go again to frame one and change the mouth shape, G, and move down to this one. And test again. Hello, I'm Piggy. So when doing lip syncing, you will combine this guy with this guy. So the size of the mouth is automated. We will learn how to and the shape, you will have to change it manually here. So this is it, I guess. Let's go back to the action editor, control tab. And for our piggy intro or piggy intro, maybe dot talk. Let's make it as a fake user so we don't lose it. Maybe we can go to the NLA and push this animation down. And we will have this. We will learn how to draw. Well, since all of the bones were keyframed, nothing is happening except the talking. What if we changed from replace to combine? I'm we will have we this. Will learn how to draw. How to draw. Isn't this beautiful? Hello, I'm 
I'm walking and talking and blinking piggy. Just like that. We will learn how to draw. This is the end of part 7. Subscribe, leave a like, and if you have any questions, leave them in the comments section. Thanks for watching and peace.